Hello everybody and welcome back to Elden Ring. I hope you're having a lovely day today. I'm having a blast playing this game, but I'm definitely stressing it a little bit just trying to beat it. <laughs> I got two days left. Um, honestly, less than that, really just one full day and then whatever's left of today, so... Um, but anyways, we're, we're plugging along, we're doing okay. Um, and the last time, what do we do? Oh yeah, we we're looking for Knight Dialos. Where is Dialos? We did do a little hunting for... Um, Classic, classic. We did do some hunting for... Whatchamacallit? Oh, yikes. Whoa. Didn't mean to come in here while you were dressing. <laughs> um, wait, there he is. Why didn't we see him before? He looks sad. Alright, let's see. What's your what's your deal? Ah, it's you, is it? I'm terribly Are you sorry, asking? But would you mind giving me some time to myself? I haven't achieved anything at all thus far. Even though I've dirtied my hands time and time again, I'm still yet to achieve anything. Perhaps I am a fool after all. No, it's worse than that. As things stand, I've given up on the path of revenge and sullied the name of my house. What an easy mark I must have been. How did it take me That's so long true. to realize honestly? There's just no end to my foolishness, is there? Well... All it takes is one day to realize that you're going the wrong path and to course correct, so... He feels like a fool because he is, but what I'm saying is it's alright. Perhaps I am a fool after all. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's worse than that. As things stand, what an easy mark. Perhaps I know. What an easy mark. Hmm. So, you've blooded your sword. Oh, your yes, heart. I have. Then Took I some heads. Introduce myself once more. But now. A recusant just like you. Mm -hmm. Recusants have particular battle arts styled to our methods of slaughter. Mm. Why not add some to your repertoire? I think methinks I will. Oh yes. Eruption. Eruption skill of the knights who served at Volcano Manor. Slam armament into the ground, spawning roiling lava which spouts up upon release. Usable on large and colossal swords, axes, and hammers. Hey, I like that. And they got Assassin's Gambit. Um, skill that masks the user's presence at the cost of a self-inflicted wound. Grants near invisibility and silences footsteps. Uh, okay. This might be good. I don't think it is. But that's alright. Because Roiling Lava, I mean, we just use um, a regular, whatchamacallit, a volcano um, pot. And then we're good. But it's nice to have options. And so that's nice. And let's just talk now. That's just you and me, buddy. To understand now, eh? mm hmm To take power and make it his own. The recusant must hunt his own kind. To raise the flag of revolt against this sanctified pillaging, we recusants must become the most wretched of predators. All you can do is laugh. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Very true, very true indeed. Oh, oh not had you fill it. Well. Okay. Okay, so we can go and um Well first of all, I guess let's talk to her. Nah, let's not talk to her yet. Let's talk to Lady Tanith first. I see you've performed another task for us. Yes, I have. Here is your usual reward. Please. I think I forgot to look at the other one you gave me. Take it. Ooh, Serpentine Blade. Nice. Now, perhaps the time has come to tell you of the true ruler of this manor, Lord Rikard. The Erd Tree blessed the Tarnished with grace, but it was all too meager in the face of the enormity of their task. The Tarnished were forced to scavenge, squabbling for crumbs, like the Shardbearers vying for power in the wake of the Shattering. Our Lord, indignant, has refused to scurry about, fighting over what miserly scraps they allow us. If the Erd Tree, and indeed the very gods, would debase us so, then we are willing to raise the banner of resistance even if it means heresy. We at the Volcano Manor, under Lord Rikard, have sworn no rest until it is done. 
If you follow this heroic path, one day the Lord will see you. Mm. The Lord's visits with our champions are always a spectacle. It cannot come a day too soon. <laughs> if you follow this, it cannot... Okay, nice. Okay, and then let's talk to Patchy Wachi, our bestest friend. Uh, I actually don't really like him that much. He's not that cool to me. Hello again. Welcome to Patchy. The request is what, what? What do you got to sell? Nothing still. You hunted down Tragoth. Are you certain? He was a tough guy. Oh, it's quite all right. Fine work indeed. I'll give Talith the news. Have some rest by all means. Cheers for that. Forgot something on you? No, no trouble. Try to find it in your heart next time. <laughs> okay, buddy. Alright, so if we go back here. Let's see, let's see. What will change now? You got anything for me, buddy? Hello again. <laughs> Sharper than you seem. Mm-hmm. Yep. I was just holding on to it for you. I bet yeah. you were. There you go. The reward for hunting Tragoth. All yours. Magma Whip Candlestick. Stingy. Try to find <laughs> okay, so let's see that uh, Magma Whip. Sounds pretty fancy there. Here it is. This ritual implement is a three-pronged candlestick with solid flames formed of the magma of Mount Gilmir. When wielded as a weapon, the flames become supple whips of lava. And it has a unique skill. Sea of magma, swing a molten whip overhead to temporarily cover the surrounding area in a sea of magma. Hold to continue swinging the, uh, the, the lava whip. Very nice. And then we also got, um, I don't even remember what I just got. I literally can't remember what I just got. I got magma something. I know I got this from her. Wait, no, not this. Nope. 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 Okay, I have no idea what I got. Maybe it was this? Great spiraling stream of fire that burns the area before the caster charging. Yeah, be fire beguiles those who gaze into it. And so uh, uh, the guardians of the flame are also its worshippers. No, this is what I got. Magma shot. Okay, fires a lump of magma that explodes on contact, charging enhances potency. After discovering the ancient hexes of Gelmer, Rykard, son of Queen Rinala, brought them back into practical use. Okay, that's the same thing that's said here. Okay. Uh, I don't remember what we just got from her, though. I literally can't remember it. So. Oh, I did forget to say, um, I did find this thing. Maybe I'm blind? Maybe I'm just blind? The thing was here the whole time. That we got that from killing one of the other dudes. The, uh, the other um, tarnished. So let's see what this says. Small mysterious bottle with a dark mist sealed within. It eliminates all sound made by the wearer during movement. A ritual implement used by round table hold assassins. There was a time when tarnished who strayed from guidance feared nothing more than utter silence. Interesting. I see. Okay, let's go talk to baby girl. What up? What are those? Brave tarnished. What is your business here? I'm afraid this is not a guest room. What's that peculiar look upon your face? Goodness. Am I still a serpent? Oh, how dreadful. How dreadful indeed. Oh, forgive my distress. I ought to be thanking you for treating me as usual, despite this appearance. Yeah, I don't judge. Brave tarnished. This is my true form. My real name is Zarias. Mm. Please forgive the deception. Do understand. This duplicity is my own doing. Lady Tanith speaks no falsehoods. And the volcano manor is just as it seems. Mm. I don't know about that. Lady Tanith is my mother. I am 
told I was born by the grace of a glorious king, that my mother cherishes this form I inhabit. I am proud of what I am, but people are cruel. If they saw my true form, they wouldn't speak to me, and so I assume a guise when seeking new recruits. But you are not like the rest. Mm -mm. I'm here for the long run. My serpentine form and the name Zarias were secrets known only to Lady oh, Dennis and I. She's letting me in on her but secrets. I share the secrets with you as well. Please keep them safe from anyone else. My serpent were secrets. Now I share them. Please keep them. You got it, girl. You got it. Let's see if uh, Lady Tanith has anything to say about this. If you follow this, it cannot come. Zoraeus's form. Did you see her? The girl, Raya. With her true face. Mm. Well, if she confided in you the name Zoraeus, then perhaps it is not my place to speak. But as her adoptive mother... I ask of you, please, be kind to her. Look after young Zarias. Her true visage belies the purity of her heart. Honestly, I hardly deserve the sweet child. Hmm. Please, her true visage... Okay, nice, nice, nice. Let's see if we have anything else we can say to her, and then I think we have to teleport back. Okay, so now we come back here, and I think Dialos is going to be, you know, ready to accept that he was a loser and he doesn't have to be anymore. And that's what's really important in life. Oh, look, she's back to normal. And... It's just as my noble brother says. I'm a complete fool. I can't believe I thought I could become a champion. Perhaps I am a fool after all. No, it's worse than that. As things stand, I've given up on the path of revenge and sullied the name of my house. What an easy mark I must have been. Perhaps I am. No, it's worse. What an easy mark. Oh, uh, okay. Maybe I have to do something. Perhaps I am a fool. No, what an easy mark. Uh, okay, let's uh, pick this up though. The red letter. Ooh, okay, okay, okay. Let's see what that's about. Okay, a written request from Volcano Manor disclosing the name of a tarnish to be hunted. As the final request, the letter is Vivid Red. Juno Hoslow, Knight of Blood. He can be found in the mountaintops of the giants. Find the red mark. Oh, okay. So maybe we want to finish this before we actually go and see him. Um, Rikard? Yeah, we'll, we'll do that. So let me go first of all talk to baby girl. Baby girl. Um, oh, it's you. Couldn't recognize me? Forgive me. My mind never ceases to churn of late. Hmm, well... I know I can trust you. Yeah. I saw something slithering in the pitch black of night. It entered the room next to this one and never came out. If I'm not mistaken, it took the form of a serpent, just like me. Does the volcano manor hide some secret that Lady Tanith has kept from me? I realize that I shouldn't impose, but... If you discover anything, would you please share? Sure. The serpent that led entered the room. Perhaps the mana yet hold if you discover it. Okay, you got it, girl. Um, I could talk to Lady Tanith again, but I think she's just gonna say, please be gentle to Raya or whatever. If you follow this, it cannot come and Oh. She said that to you. I should have known something was wrong. The signs were clear enough. Well, Zarias has placed her trust in you. All the more reason I must tell you. 
that some things are better left unknown. Besides, no one should be blamed for their heritage. Think about it. We are resisting the ways of the Erd Tree itself. What matters one's lineage in such a crisis? Hmm. Zarias has placed her that some things are. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. So then let's go see Jarbaron. Or, yeah, Jarbaron, I think, is his name. He's gotta be willing to talk, willing to do something. Like, he's gotta be looking for an apostate, right? Oh, hello again, cuz. Have you heard? A new potentate's come to the village. I think he said his name oh, was okay. Dialos. He seems a little down in the dumps, but his hands as smooth as silk. I don't know. I'm a little disappointed, actually. Even though good Sir Dialos has a wonderful suit of armor, he says he isn't a warrior. And since he's a coward, he won't be fighting anymore. <laughs> His smooth and silky hands feel nice when he pats us. But I wish we had a potentate big and strong like you. Mm hmm Dialysis smooth and silky hands, but I wish we... Okay, let me go see him. Bring me Dialos. Full of beans. No wonder you're covered in muck. <laughs> oh, he cleans them. Oh, my friend, it's been far too long. I have to say, you caught me at a rather low point. But as you see, I put all that behind me. Left the volcano manor, forging my own path now, making my own choices. Even a fool like me can look after some simple jars. Do you pity me? Well, don't. I feel like for the first time in my life, I'm on the straight and narrow. Nice. A fool I may. Do you pity me? Well, don't. A fool I may be. Do you pity me? Okay. You know, I'm happy for him. He found his purpose. Um, let's see. I know there is an end to his story. Let's see if it happens now. <laughs> He's dreaming about his hands now. Okay, nice, nice. What time is it? Oh, it's late day. A fool I may you pity me. Okay, let's see. It's still late day. Okay, I think I think we can't do anything to progress this storyline right now, so let's just uh go back. And go here I'm kind of wondering if I should progress um, this place snakes not on my watch I'm the exterminator And I've come to exterminate.
Oh. Oh, come on. There we go. Ah, he got me. Nomadic Cookbook 12, I'm just curious. Cursed Blood Pot, nice. Hey, here we go. Depraved Perfumer Carmen. Okay. Alright, sure. Where where are they? Here they are. Okay, um Used to summon the spirit of Carman, the depraved perfumer. Depraved perfumers practice their art for themselves alone. Carmain was not a notable formidable a notably formidable perfumer whose strength rivaled that of heroes, and it is said that he was in search of a secret physic of revivification. Interesting, interesting. I can't do it? Okay, whatever. No other secrets here, right? Okay, so I'm thinking... Hmm. Because I need to progress here normally anyways to um, finish her story, Raya. And she's the one character that I accidentally killed. I literally accidentally one hit kill her. Um, because they... It was a point in the story where you had a choice whether you wanted to kill her or not. And of course, I didn't know that. I thought she was an enemy because she was not in her normal place and I killed her. And I was so sad and there was no way to uh, to revive her. So it's really important to me for my own satisfaction that I, uh, I save her this time. I literally saw it as I, I did like a jump attack, right? And I saw it just a little too late and I couldn't stop it. Um, oh, okay. So I need to actually go in there, go in there. I can do that. Um, impressive. I'm really impressed that he made it up there, but... Oh, wow. Got him. We've got the Bloodhound's Claw. That is somewhere here, I think. Yeah, there it is. Okay, large curved claws used by Bloodhound Knights. The curve allows the weapon to slip through an enemy's guard. And it's got Bloodhound Step. Okay. Great. Okay, don't mind me, just breaking their pots. Is this where I came from? Oh yeah, yeah. No, no, I think this is where I came from. Right, there was a thing up here? Yeah, 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 yeah. My bad, my bad. Got a little turned around there. It's dark. You know what I'm saying? Ah. Here we are. Church is cancelled yet again. I'm so sorry, everybody. You don't even worship the earth tree, so, you know. You shouldn't be having church anyways, in my opinion. Just saying.
Okay. Let's go see what we see. Ah, welcome to hell. Where does the lava come from? We may never know. But this is the true... The true volcano manor. In all its horrors. I feel like it's not going to take much to go through here. But I don't know. Ugh. Kind of hate that. Oh, wow. Those guys are strong, though. How come I'm not seeing the name? Why does he have a volcanic stone? Sure. Okay, we'll explore the rooftops first. Before descending into the underbelly, the ugly under underbelly. Oh, actually, kind of out of time, but that's okay. shard nice nice buddy nice got gold runes uh, there was a snake here right yeah Okay, and here we go. Um, I don't know if, why we did this. I guess we did this just for that. There's an item there. Haha, <laughs> she can't get to me. You know what? Come and get me. Wow, they are so strong. She's actually so strong, though. Why are they- why did they take so much to kill? What the heck? But I guess that's how you know you're not, you're not supposed to be here. But I'm, I'm thinking my plan is maybe clear out this area and then we, we just, you know, move along. Okay, it's pretty much time anyways, so maybe we won't do this. We'll just go here and talk to her. Talk to Raya and tell her what's going on and then we'll talk to um, Lady Tani. And then we'll progress. We'll, pro we'll progress the main plot because we need to, we need to get to the mountaintops of the giants anyways. Tell her of the dark side of Volcano Man. Really? Oh, so there was a secret after all. Mm -hmm. Oh my. Lady Tanith. 
My own mother has deceived me. There's another thing. Was I not born by the grace mm -mm. of the king? Mm -mm. She ain't even your mom. My, was I not born by the... Lady Tanith, what do you have to say for yourself? If you follow this, it cannot... Okay, so you got nothing to say. All right, buddy boy, you got anything for me? Hello again. You got nothing. All right. Bun you, buddy. All right, whatever. So with that in mind, let's actually go back to Cathedral of the Forsaken. Frame. Nope, not there. Where do we want to go? Um, I think this is where we want to go. And we will um, progress the main plot a little bit. And um, yeah, that'll be good. So thanks for watching YouTube. See you when I see you. Bye.